All right, next question we have from a lady. Um, I have the following doubts about our IRS tax return. Don't we all? I'm ready to sign and mail them as I, as we have been taught yet. Since still, I have not received the passport certified application. Can I still sign non-assumption? You can sign any way you want on any government form that you want on the 1040s. Personally, I would cross out that entire last paragraph. Or it says, I am a taxpayer. I'm agreeing under the pains of melons of perjury. Now, if they respond to that with something frivolous, like a frivolous claim, we've already written a letter that you can do in response to that, where it's uh, another pains and penalties of perjury that all the information filed on that IRS tax return is true and correct to the best of your knowledge. That way, you're giving them what they need to dismiss the frivolous element of the 1040, but not signing the tax return. 